good morning to all sit in sukhasan hands resting on the knees in jnana mudra or chin mudra sit erect close your eyes start prayer Om Om Let's move on to the next one, neck movement. Place your hand on your lap in chin mudra position. Sit erect. Close your eyes. Now, breathe out. Bring your head down, touching your chest with your chin. Breathe in, bring your head up, stretching backwards, be aware of your neck bones. Repeat this for three times. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, breathe out. Inhale. Exhale, relax. Now we move on to the next one, neck rotation movement. Exhale, bring your head down, touching your chest with your chin. Rotate your head from right side to the half way. Inhale, complete the rotation bringing to the normal position. Exhale, do it anti-clockwise. Exhale, repeat this for three times. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. 
एक्सहेल इनहेल एक्सहेल इनहेल ना डू इट एंटी क्लॉक वाइज इनहेल एक्सहेल इनहेल एक्सहेल इनहेल एक्सहेल इनहेल एक्सहेल रिलैक्स स्लोली ब्रीथ इन ब्रीथ आउट ब्रीथ इन ब्रीथ आउट सिट इन सुखासन नाउ वी स्टार्ट हैंड मूवमेंट्स द फर्स्ट वन फिंगर्स क्लिंचिंग मूवमेंट नाउ वी स्टार्ट हैंड मूवमेंट्स हैंड मूवमेंट्स हेल्प अस in relieving the stress and also help us in strengthening the hand muscles the first movement is fingers clenching movement first stretch your hands to your shoulder level exhale close your fingers covering your thumb inhale release your fingers now we repeat this for three times exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale relax put your hands down breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out now we move on to wrist bending movement first stretch your hands to your shoulder level exhale bring your palms downwards inhale bring your palms upwards now we repeat them for three times exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale relax now put your hands down now breathe in breathe out slowly breathe in and breathe out now we move on to the third movement wrist rotation movement first stretch your hands to your shoulder level fold your fingers and rotate your wrist in clockwise direction repeat this for four times rotate your wrist in clockwise direction for four times now repeat your wrist in anti clockwise direction for four times repeat your wrist in anti clock direction for four times relax put your hands down now slowly breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out 
now we switch over to the next movement elbow bending movement first stretch your hands to your shoulder level palms facing upwards exhale place your fingers to rest on your shoulders inhale release them now we repeat this for 3 times exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale now relax put your hands down breathe in breathe out slowly breathe in and slowly breathe out please stand up now we switch over to tadasan samasthiti now let's look at the technique of tadasan raise your hands slowly above your head and interlock your fingers turning your palms upwards and inhale raise your body slowly on your toes now exhale raise your body downwards touching ground with your feet repeat this 3 times inhale exhale inhale exhale slowly inhale exhale hands down and relax let's start tiryak tadasan let's see the technique in tiryak tadasan raise your hands above your head and interlock your fingers turning your palm upwards and exhale and turn your body to your right side now breathe in and come to natural position now exhale and then turn your body slowly to your left side and breathe in now come to natural position repeat this for 3 times exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale breathe in breathe out breathe in put your hands down slowly now relax now now let's switch over to parsvatadasan let's look at the technique in parsvatadasan raise your hands slowly above your head and interlock your fingers turning your palm upwards and inhale exhale slowly bend your body to your right side 
Now inhale and come to the natural position. Now exhale, bend your body to your left side. Inhale and come to the natural position. Repeat it for three times. Exhale, slowly, inhale, exhale, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, Breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, put your hands down slowly. and relax. So, now let's switch over to Udara Karasana. Let's see the techniques in this posture. First, stretch your arms forward up to shoulder level. Exhale, turn your body to the right side slowly. Touching right shoulder with left hand. Inhale and come to normal position. Now exhale, turn your body to the left side, touching left shoulder with the right hand. Inhale, come to the normal position. Repeat this three times. Exhale. Hmm. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, breathe out, breathe in, Breathe out, breathe in. Let us repeat all the steps one by one. Step one, Pranamasana. Step two, Hasta Uttasana. Step 3, Pada Hastasana. Step 4, Ashva Sanchalanasana. Step 5, Dandasana. Step 6, Astanga Namaskara. Step 7, Bhujangasana. Step 8, Parvatasana. Step 9, Ashva Sanchalanasana.
స్టెప్ టెన్ పాద హస్తాసనం స్టెప్ లెవెన్ హస్త ఉత్తాసనం ప్రణామాసనం రిలాక్స్ రేజ్ యువర్ హ్యాండ్స్ అప్ బ్రింగ్ యువర్ హ్యాండ్స్ డౌన్ now let us repeat all the steps one more time step 1 pranamasana step 2 hasta uttasana step 3 pada hastasana step 4 ashva sanchalanasana step 5 dandasana step 6 ashtanga namaskara step 7 bhujangasana step 8 parvatasana step 9 ashva sanchalanasana step 10 pada hastasana step 11 hasta uttasana step 12 pranamasana now relax raise your hands up bring slowly bring them down Now slowly breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out. Now let us repeat all the steps one by one. Step 1, Pranamasana. step 2 hasta uttasana step 3 pada hastasana step 4 ashva sanchalanasana step 5 dandasana step 6 ashtanga namaskara step 7 bhujangasana step 8 parvatasana step 9 ashva sanchalanasana step 10 pada hastasana step 11 hasta uttasana step 12 pranamasana now relax raise your hands up bring them slowly bring them down breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out 
ನಾವು ಶವಾಸನ ನಾವು ಸ್ಲೋಲಿ ಲೈ ಡೌನ್ ಆನ್ ಯುವರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ leave some space between both the legs stretch your hands a little now slowly inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale now samasthiti bring your both legs together hands together slowly get up and sit yoga nidra the yogic power nap and why you need it you need to know it yoga brings deep rest to the body and mind it is not only rejuvenates your mind but also adds vigor to the body it's a good idea to end your daily yoga practice with yoga nidra or yogic sleep simply described as effortless relaxation yoga nidra is essential and to any yoga pose sequence while yoga poses warm up the body yoga nidra cools it down this closing yoga asana involves consciously taking your attention to different parts of body and relaxing them yoga practices increase the energy levels in the body yoga nidra helps conserve and consolidate this energy and relax the entire system thereby preparing it for this energy for pranayama and meditation it is therefore important to keep aside sufficient time for yoga nidra in your yoga time how to do yoga nidra so there are some steps that tell you how to do this yoga nidra let us see them lie down straight on your back in calf pose that is shavasana close your eyes and relax take a few deep breaths in and out remember to take slowly and relaxed breaths two to five times start gently taking your attention to your right foot keep your attention and concentration there for a few seconds while relaxing your foot then gently move your attention up to the right knee right thigh and hip become aware of your whole right leg repeat the same process to the left side that is concentrate now on left foot keep your attention there for a few seconds while relaxing your foot then gently move your attention up to the left knee left thigh and hip now become aware of your whole left leg 
pay your attention to the all parts of body stomach relax navel region relax and chest relax pay your attention to the right shoulder right arm palms and fingers repeat this on the left shoulder left arm throat face and finally to the top of head take a deep breath in and observe the sensations in your body relax in this position for a few minutes slowly aware of your body and surroundings turn your right side lying down for a few more minutes rolling over to the right side and makes the breath flow through the left nostril which helps cool the body take your own time you may then slowly sit up and whenever you feel comfortable slowly and gradually open your eyes kapalabhati is also known as skull shining breath kapala means skull and bhati means light the emphasis is on the exhalation through strong fast abdominal contractions and so has a cleansing effect on the breathing pathways now let us see the benefits of this kapalabhati it improves circulation especially to the brain which gives the skull shining effect energizing the mind and waking up your system kapalabhati also creates heat and increases and stimulates the digestive fire which is also called agni by strengthening massaging and toning the abdominal muscles and digestive system let us see the kapalabhati technique the inhale follows naturally after the strong exhale relax now slowly inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale now let us repeat this kapalabhati one more time the inhale follows naturally after the strong exhale relax slowly inhale exhale inhale exhale now let us see the meaning of surya bhedana in yogic terminology the right nostril referred to the gateway of sun energy or pingala nadi and left nostril is gateway of moon energy or ida nadi sun energy is the representation of 
heart or masculine vitality in the body while moon energy represents calmness or feminine vitality if we go by the literal meaning of surya bhedana surya means sun bhedana means piercing or entering surya bhedana pranayama is the deep inhalation of breath through the right nostril then holding the breath for as long as comfortable and finally exhaling through the left nostril now sit in any comfortable position but sit erect form prana mudra with your right hand when you close your right nostril use your right thumb when you close your left nostril use your right finger ring finger and little finger if the deep inhalation of breath through the right nostril then holding the breath for as long as comfortable and finally exhaling through the left nostril let us do it inhale through right nostril hold it for some time exhale it through left nostril now repeat this inhale through right nostril hold it for some time exhale through left nostril inhale exhale hold exhale inhale inhale hold exhale inhale hold exhale inhale hold exhale inhale hold exhale relax let us move on to the next one brahmari pranayama it is also known as humming bee breath let us see the benefits of this posture brahmari relieves stress and cerebral tension it also helps elevating anger anxiety and insomnia now sit in a comfortable meditation asana close the eyes and relax the whole body for a short time put your index fingers in both of your ears and start listening to the humming sound within your body the humming sound should be smooth even and continuous for the duration of the exhalation start swasti prayer सर्वेश 
स्वस्तिभवतु ओम सर्वे शांतिभवतु ओम सर्वे शांतिभवतु ओम शांति 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 हरि ओम तस् ओम नमः ओम नमः थैंक यू